All right, so um, what I want to do now is I want to show you how these three basic submissions can fit together. Now, by no means are any of these basic setups probably viable past blue belt. Okay? In terms of omoplatas, you're looking at like your dew claw position, you're going to be triangling your legs, you're going to be doing heaps of different things to make sure your partner can't posture up, make sure you can't drive weight into you, can't step over your head and stuff like that. Um, this, this is just a complete set of basics for, some, for someone that's done jiu-jitsu for three months where I can show you the basic positions of your hips and the major things you're looking for to make sure that the submission will work. Um, what we're going to do now though is I want to put this into a context where you might actually start catching these submissions by chaining submissions together. So this is a really, really fun drill to do uh, with your partner. So from here we are looking to start set up this armbar and I'm in my armbar position. What's going to happen now is my partner's going to pull his bottom arm out. Now as his bottom arm comes out, my leg clears his ear straight away, his head straight away. This sound gets pushed across my body, I go to my shin lockdown position here. I then start chasing my angle, there's my triangle finish right there. Now the other option off this arm bar here, is he pulls that bottom arm out, and I cut the angle the other way. I don't look for the triangle, I look straight away for my Kimura position, uh, my seated Kimura position, aka the omoplata, right here. Sitting up, getting my finish. Now the other thing I can do, so I'm setting up my own partner now, my partner drives his weight into me, as he drives his weight into me, I now capture my triangle back here. I lock it up, I get my arm position, I then go about cutting my angle to finish my triangle. So what you'll find with all these positions and submissions is using them together to create threats that your partner has to answer or then be giving you setups to the old pliers, the triangles and the arm bars. Okay? So to recap one more time nice and slow, we start with our arm bar in here. I'm looking for my arm bar. He's smart, he pulls that arm out, he knows if he breaks down the lever I'm trying to build, I can't actually finish the submission. But from here, I transition around to my triangle straight away. The other thing we can look at, I hit my arm bar and he drives into me. So I start cutting my extreme angle towards his hip. I get my parallel angle, okay, and I need to sit up while I grab his hip. I open his shoulder up, I apply my own bar. And then the last one that we looked at in here, I'm setting up my own platter here and he drives into me. As he drives into me, I capture my triangle position. I lock it up, make sure the arm's on the right side, and I keep cutting the angle.